The Auburn Tigers have been hard at work all spring trying to build off an up and down year under one year head coach Hugh Freeze. Tyler White was in Auburn for their 8 day spring game with the culmination of the Tigers work so far. Hey there, Wiregrass here at Jordan Hare Stadium as the Tigers are in action, bringing their spring practice sessions to a wrap with their 8 day spring game. And if you came here looking for offense, no luck here. The Tiger defense flying around early and often in this game, finishing with four sacks, 12 tackles for loss, and six pass breakups. This team understands that if you want to slow down an offense, you have to set the tone at the line of scrimmage. We need those young kids like DJ Reed and Bobby to come on, and I thought DJ made a couple plays in the backfield. TJ Lindsey showed up. Um, yeah, obviously the two young ends are going to be very talented, and um, I was excited. But I thought I thought the D line kind of dominated the line of scrimmage today. But it wasn't all bad news for the offense. A big bright spot on that side of the ball was true freshman wide receiver Cam Coleman getting going quick with a long diving play for his second catch of the game, ending with four catches for 92 yards as well as the game's only touchdown. I know in this league, I know in this in the SEC, the DBs are not just going to let you just. Like, catch the ball like a days are cool. Uh, you got to be aggressive when you catch the ball and really just hold on to it. It's really like a, um, yeah, like a preview of what's to come later on in the future. But the offense doesn't necessarily have to fire on all cylinders when the true freshman kicker from right down the road at Auburn High School, Towns Magoo, comes in and makes seven of seven field goals, including a 58-yard game winner. Yeah, like I said, growing up Auburn fan my whole life, um, just meant everything to me, uh, getting that opportunity to do it today and be trusted by my teammates and coaches. So it was really a dream come true. So all in all, Coach Hugh Free said he felt like the team had a successful spring, but that does not mean there are not things still to clean up come the fall. In Jordan-Hare Stadium in Auburn, I'm Tyler White, WDH Sports for the Wiregrass. Back to you guys.